guys, uh, today I wanted to show you a project I made for uh, my DT project for Sweet Nothing Stamp Company. And this month I made a card using Tomboy Sophie. And Tomboy Sophie is a new release for the month of June. And I couldn't wait to uh, play with her and um, kind of, you know, Copic color and um, paper piece her. So I was just really excited to do this. And this is the card I came up with. And um, she is um, Copic colored. So her skin, her shoes, her hair um, is all Copic colored. And then her overalls and her little t-shirt and her bow, those are paper pieced. And for the um, overalls, if you can tell it's kind of got like a denim um I guess pattern to it and that is from the crepe paper random paper pad and um then her little t-shirt is cut from the my mind's eye six by six away we go pad along with um the background papers um so I really love the way this card turned out and I really love um how cute she is she's just sitting in the tree so um i copic colored the branches as well and i cut everything out um excluding the leaves that were on the tree and that's because i used um my martha stewart um frond punch and just uh punched out some leaves and added them as the leaves for the tree and um i really really like the way this turned out I thought that her little friend here came out really cute and um, he's just really adorable and he compliments her very well and um, just a little sentiment here I added some I am roses and wild orchid crafts and I used my Martha Stewart um, classic butterfly punch uh, trio added some pearls I gave Sophie these adorable little blue earrings these little blue pearls for earrings <laughs> so I thought she turned out really cute and um, I really enjoyed making this card this month and you can find this um, digi image on the sweet nothings stamp company website which is www.sweetnothingsstampco.com and um, you will not be disappointed because the images are super cute and uh, they're very affordable and you can use them as many times as you need to. There's no limit as to how many times you can print them out and use them. You can resize them which is great if you're making a larger project or a smaller project or need to tweak it in a way. You can do that with digital images. And so the inside of the card is very simple. I just kind of off-centered the writing area and um, added some strips of paper and that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed my card and you'll check out the website and you'll check out my blog and the Sweet Nothing Stamp Company blog. Thanks so much for watching guys. Take care. Bye.